Okay, this is the little explanation about this device. This device is a data converter. Basically, it can convert in between different things. Bluetooth, Ethernet, MIDI, 485, 42, 232. So you can see the connections on the back. That's MIDI. That's Ethernet if you want to use Wi-Fi. Uh, you might need a separate wireless access point. Uh, you, 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 um, they are so popular, so you can find one easily. Uh, these are the connections. You can also uh, power that from two batteries. Actually, you need only one battery, but it won't last long. But in case you have just one, you can run it from one. Two batteries just work a uh, longer. So this is it. You connect that to the MIDI um, interface of the desk, which is here. Usual stuff. This is the MIDI. And you set it up. Now you turn it on. Okay, now these buttons are needed to select the interfaces you can you want to convert in between. So if we hit one button, we scroll until we hit the interfaces that we need. For example, we want to do uh, MIDI to RS232. So we stop here. Uh, we wait a little bit for Bluetooth in initialization. Okay, now we want to select another button to make sure we are in 232. So we scroll and set it up so that this station converts in between two of them. Okay? But we're not doing the 232 at the moment, we're doing MIDI. So we select again. All right. Uh, we select again Bluetooth and MIDI. Let's wait a little bit. Okay, select another one. It's now MIDI. So, now it's ready. So we run the software, it is searching for the Bluetooth devices around. It may find all sorts of mobile phones and other stuff, computers, but anyway this is the name of my device, this station. Select that, I hit OK. It's now connecting and the LED goes blue. Okay, synchronizing. And this is it basically. If I'm in the main view, you can uh, see the faders moving. If you see the faders, I'm moving the, the channel 1. So, see the faders move? That's it. So, you can see how responsive it is. There is no latency whatsoever. It is very responsive. That's it. I close that and work for further. I will explain the, in detail this interface in some other video. Uh, my name is Yuri Beklemishev and uh, I'll see you in uh, some other time. Thanks for your attention. You need to go to... Uh, if you go to the Apple store,